I'm thinking to do now the soldier's pick to unlock the storage. I think we do that. Because I hear here is the and only here we are. chest where you can store break. items. Maker's breath. Look at the size of her. What a fortress. I told you the map would get us through the tunnels. Mm, how did you find that path on your own? You wouldn't believe me if I told you. Just tell me. It came to me in my dreams. When I was a lad, I tried going through the tunnel by myself. Got horribly lost. But every now and again since, I've dreamt of it. Uh, why didn't you mention this before? I didn't want you to think I was some moon-addled simpleton. I've me wits about me, but enough of that. I'll follow you from a distance. This place has the stench of death. I expect there's trouble up ahead. Soldier's Peak. Looks like it's seen better days. Better centuries, more like. Once the Wardens flourished, their ranks full, their caliber certain. Now they even accept people like you. Uh, Alistair. wait a second. Hey. Oh? Mm -hmm. Any, I want to, uh, any ally threatened. Oh, wait. I'm still confused a little bit about this orders. A lot of dead bodies here. Fall back! 
Fall back already! Taking the peak will not be easy, my lord. I gave the wardens one chance to die with honor. Instead, they hole up like cowards. We follow the king's advice, then. Starve them out. But the peak has months of supplies. Then we wait. When they are too weak to lift their weapons, we will send them to their final judgment. Mm. What was that? Felt a bit woozy there. I'm not mad, am I? A vision. You saw it too. I've heard a Norwegian ballad about something like this. A beauty trapped in a dream. In the song, Belisa never wakes up. Your prissy friend here is making me nervous, Warden. How's this even possible? The place must truly be haunted. Uh, this, the veil is here. The circle tower was that way too. The veil? That's what separate separate us from the fade and demons. Demons? Thank Andraste you came, Warden. <laughs> After you. Thank you. Statue. Hmm. Okay. These oh. Things have unusual powers. Ah! Be wary. Ah! Ah! Too I easy. You should run while you can. Oh, you are funny, Montuga. Quickly, you must fight. Ah! Another battle, I see. Good. What? Ah. More. These bodies wasn't here. Man, what the heck they keep respawning? Very well. They keep respawning. Guys, at that. Very well. Oops. 
Oh, come on, man, she died. For the fool's way! No quarter shall we get! Okay, no more, please. Take a break. Very well. As you say. I really need this mana. Potion. Okay, let's go up the sail. Firebolt. Uh, wait, I don't have the bath. Alistair here. Ah! Okay, the boss done. Let's go inside. What the hell is the inside? The morale is low. My spells are of no use in this matter, Commander. There is more to leading men than sorcery, Avernus. I will remind them that they're wardens. Men, I won't lie to you. The situation is grim. Our forces outnumbered, our bellies empty, and our hearts are sagging. But we are wardens! Darkspawn flee when they hear our horns. Archdemons die when they taste our blades. So are we to bend knee to a mere human despot? No! I, for one, will never give up! I, for one, will never surrender just to dance on Arlen's gallows. So I propose here and now, in these hallowed halls where generations of our brethren stood vigil against darkspawn and evil, that we send a message to that fat bastard. In this sacred place, proud men, strong men, stood defiant and would rather die than submit to tyranny. <laughs> Nice speech! So brave, even when starving. And my great-great-grandmother stood with them. Uh... <clears throat> it sounds like there is greatness in your blood. Oh, well, that's kind of you to say. Generations of Drydens have said that our stock were lions. Fierce, proud, and noble. But I've gabbed enough. Lead on, my friend. Okay, my friend. What that? On these grounds, Virtus men stood against a tyrant. They stood defined and stood for freedom, and they died. By the Grey Warden defender who was besieged by King Arland forces. Read the names of the fallen. Captain Mello. The Black Ferret, Che Trevor Lopez, Sir Derek of Orlais, and Jason the Longbow. Alan the Quibble, Cartography Martyr, David the Silent, Dustin the Color Blind, Ebanger of the Bovin Britain, Para of the Th this, this is Bakers of the Game, or what the fuck?
I shall do it. Now we do battle! Good job, guys. Which door we take? It is begun. Oh, I think they've seen us. Oh, that's a mistake. I shall do it. Your time to die. It is done. This is done. I know. Uh, Lil Liliana, I please. Do that for you. Please. Thank you. A shitty helmet. And a shitty maze. Soldier pick is more than we bargained for. A sinister magic at work here. Ooh. The men are seeing things and cannot tell nightmare from reality. The fallen return to life to attack again and again, and we are assaulted by dark creatures, the like of which I have never seen. Whoever is responsible is intent on destroying us all. The king's army and the Grey Warden both send help. We cannot last much longer. Looks like the help didn't arrive. Or we are the help, but we are too late. <laughs> For them. Oh, another note. How dare you to miss things. Even the children. Sophia. It's too hard to save. I shall do it. As you say. This will... I was sure. Spawning, man. A book. It shall be done.
We discover another piece of the puzzle. There must be more to this, okay. Oh! Andraste's blood! What? More of Ernest! Whatever it takes! Kaylee A. Benfotos Victos! Press them! Press them now! Okay. Oh my god. No! I command you, fight the king's men! Ooh. So much death, suffering, and oh yes, blood. The veil is torn now. They speak. Your soul is mine, Avernus. Acolytes, retreat now. The battle is lost. Avernus! What does that Oh no, more fighting. These things have... Yeah. There are more. This guy don't help us. Shall be done. Man, there are more. Oh my god, my tank is dead. My dog is dead.
Here! We cannot use stound. On my way. Come on, bro, use the fucking town. Don't have stamina. They keep respawning. Defend yourself. That was insane. The warden summoned my mother. She knew. Warden don't forbid blood magic. Anything it takes to win. I believed that my family was better than that. But answers may lay up ahead. Okay. Uh, Let's go. We need Song of Valor again. Um, you need uh, a lesser injury kit. Oh! Wait a second. Cold resistant, cold damage. Radiates cold. Uh, this is good for Morrigan. Oh, wait, require 36 magic? What? Man, more than half 36 magic? Yes. It is begun. Uh, what the hell are that things? That portal? As you say. There's something with that portal. Oh crap. These are unusual parts. Be wary. Very well. Best be wary. Defend yourself.
Good job, guys. Very well. Fire crystal. Uh, here it's a magic barrier. Okay. I shall do it. Uh, this two statue. Who the fuck are you? Step no further. Get this annoyance what? away from me. This one would speak with you. She's a zombie. Who or what are you? This one is the Dryden, Commander, Sophia. <laughs> All these things. Grandmother? You have slain many of the demon ilk to get here. This one would propose a deal. Hmm. Is anything of the real Sophia left inside you? This one has tasted her memories, seen her thoughts and hidden places. But she is food for this one. No more, no less. Levi, I'm afraid your great-great-grandmother is possessed. That or she's really let herself go. My great-great-grandmother is dead. I don't know what that is. Tell me about a deal. You can't be serious. <laughs> There's nothing left of Commander Dryden. She's possessed. Your fledgling should mind its place. Meek, subservient, quiet. This one will answer your question. The soldier's peak traps me. This one sees so many tantalizing places in the Dryden's memories. This one would see the world herself. For me to be free, into the old mage tower you go and destroy. In return, this one seals the veil. No more demons, ah. no more enemies. Your peak would be safe. Just let this one go into the world. Uh... What am I destroying? The magics, all moving things, the very stone if you have the power. Something inside keeps my kind locked away. Hmm. And what exactly will you do if I free you? This one will roam, this one will see, this one will feed. But without me, the veil will grow weaker. More demons, more misery. You choose just one of my kind, or many. Uh okay. I'm here on behalf of Levy. Tell me about Sophia Dryden. This one knows all, but will only talk after the tower lies broken. Before I make a deal. Yes. Oh man. Uh, Ethan Levy, anything you, he wants to know about Sophia? Warden, my family's been looking for answers for over a century, but not like this. Okay. The way must be mandated. Is the only way. I'll support your decision either way. Agreed. Any questions Levy has of the Dryden will be answered. Can you tell me anything about the tower? You only must destroy. For your purpose, there is nothing more you need. Persuade, sweeten the deal. What do I get out of this personally? 
the levy gets his questions answered. You get nothing more. I'm off to break the tower then. Good, good. Nothing must live. Nash stone with teeth if you can. Man, I don't know if I did a mistake. Wow, a lot of lore. This one is waiting, Warden! Break the tower! How? I think I need to go to that door. That's not the magic anymore here. Okay. That's not good. Trap right ahead. Trap right ahead. Missed. Oh no, you don't. <laughs> Right away. I shall. Thank you. I love the experience from the traps. It is begun. This one, I think, will die at the end. Very well. Okay. This appeared to be old research of the mage Avernus. They detail a series of experiments in tears. Clinic and handwriting. Day 32. The subject is not responding to the stimuli. Testing the pain threshold has uncovered nothing. Only three subjects are left. Day 82. If only I could reproduce last night's extraordinary success. Electricity is only a catalyst. The blood is the key. Day 97. Energy and blood. Repeated applications have duplicated the results. I conjecture that success can be induced alchemically. But there are no more subjects left. If only I had one more, or a dozen, the things I could do. Ah. Interesting.
culmination of awareness horrific research. It promised what promises to unlock the hidden potential of the tainted blood you drank during the joining. Hmm. Man. Drink the veal. What the heck, man? I don't know what to do, guys. Man, you get two new skills, basically a buff and a debuff. You know what? I think I will destroy. As you say. Okay, fuck her. You know? I shall do it. I hear you. Don't disrupt my concentration. You still make researchers? Even now, the demons seek to replenish their numbers. Are you to thank for this welcomed but temporary imbalance? The old warden me, you're still alive? Oh. Only just. I have only a short time left. Careful. This man has dabbled in matters forbidden by the Maker. He may look frail, but don't trust him. I so the Maker him. told you that, did he? Short-sighted men have forbidden my research, not any god. <laughs> Enough. Why are you here? What is your intent? Uh... Solder Peak must be rid of plague of his plague of demons. Agreed. This must be the first priority, the only priority. I've seen your experiments. They were necessary. Any tool, any iota of information that could defeat the fell demons was justified. As a warden, you should know that. Necessary. Having to relieve yourself after an eight-hour ride is necessary. But there's no excuse for summoning demons. <sighs> Charming. I want some answers. To what questions, I wonder? Ask. How you survive these many years? The Chantry foolishly forbids blood magic, but there are so many secrets to uncover. As my body decayed, I found ways to extend it. But that can only go so far. Hmm. 
Tell me about what happened here. What use would storytelling serve? The tyrant Arland is long dead, as is all our noble co-conspirators and the Grand Rebellion. Sophia's corpse may walk and talk, but she too is no more. I'm sure about that. What was uh, our land a tyrant? Oh. He ruled with fear and poison. His treachery pit noble against noble in terrible battle. We thought him a monster. We gathered allies to rebel. But the toll of years has erased our failure, hasn't it? It seemed so pressing then. But the kingdom lives on. Hmm. hmm. What happened uh, to the rebellion? Too many mouths to quiet. Even sorcery can only go so far. So we met with Tian Kuzland. With him on our side, we had a chance of victory. Instead, the King's Guard ambushed us. Commander Dryden and I barely escaped. You practice blood magic on the nobles? Of course, to nudge people to keep our secrets safe. Sophia should have let me nudge harder. Her scruples were her undoing. You had to know that summoning so many demons was foolhardy. Perhaps, but it was survival. <laughs> For months, I prepared the summoning circles, researched the darkest depths of the Fade. That moment was a <laughs> triumph of demonic law. Dozens of demons, called by my hand. But, with so many variables, I suppose, calculation I'll, errors were inevitable. Ugh. I'll kill you all, man. I was so close. You are, you are to blame for all this. Some things you just don't do. And who draws this line of what is safe, proper, or moral? The Chantry? Corrupt, mundane, pathetic little men. You embrace the core tenet of the wardens. Any means necessary to win. <laughs> Commander Dryden n knew of the demons. She gave the order. Oh. I would have summoned the demons anyway. Only under wardens can true magical research continue. A chance to rediscover the secrets of ancient Tevinta. Uh, you do remember how that ended? The Black City, Dark Throne? Chantry lies told to subjugate the mages to keep them docile. You sound proud of your actions. My only regret is that it failed. And that I never had a chance to make Arland pay. The time for question is over. So be it. My only request. If justice or vengeance drive you, stay your hand until the demons are dealt with. I have an oath to keep. All in this tower will die. Fuck off, man. My body may be frail, but my sorcery is not. Okay. Okay, man. There are a ton of them.
Dead. Our Tis skill has won the day. Easy. Ooh, it wasn't easy. I suppose you have a good I shall do it. Bath. As you say. Really? Robes of awareness. Willpower armor improves blood magic. I don't have a blood match, magic, magic. Not even Morrigan. Have not a use for the moment. What the fuck is that, please? It is begun. Metal kite shield. Resisted. Nice. Allow me. I Please. can do that for you. Please. As you like. Holy shit, loot. Okay, the Morrigan staff was good. As you say. Okay, anything else to do? Here. Avernus is dead. We go back to Sophia. I don't know if I made the right decision to kill Avernus. The ah, mail Sophia. Has subsided. The Magus's web is destroyed. This one remembers the deal. Come, follow. Gossamer's strands only stand between this world and home. Feel it? So deliciously weak here. So frail. The entire world should be as such. But this one will feed the veil. Make it strong. My brethren will not make it easy. Are you ready? Hmm. What are you going to, to be doing? This one will sew the strands together, make lattice with pain, experience, and exquisite agony. Man. I think I made a wrong decision. What's my part in this? You keep the brethren away from me. Then we begin. Yes. Yes. Quickly, we must fight! It is begun. Run 
while you can. Oh crap. Very well. Oh fuck. Let us end this. I cannot. I'm frozen. I cannot kill him. He will die. Alice. Okay, no more, please. It's done. Ooh. And it is done. Your veil is strong. This one has kept its word. Now this one will go. There is much to do. You didn't mention awareness. The Magus was irrelevant. You have served your purpose. Ask, human. Ask quickly. Grandmother, Sophia, she knew about the blood magic then? Yes, she did. Avernus was powerful, useful. It suited her ambitions. But my grandmother was a hero. In her own mind, yes. She aspired to rule the land of the waking, to cast out the tyrant king, to mete out justice to those who betrayed her. Cousin Arland was so coy, so devious, years before she sensed the asp. Sophia was the king's cousin. The old king died without kin, and the Dryden sought to don the crown. <laughs> but the boy Arland was thought pliable by those in power. Fools. The Dryden, powerful, charismatic, insightful, and ignored. They gave her a choice death or the wardens. She bided her time, she waited, she lived. The boy king Arlen spread terror, spread death, and the Dryden plotted. But Arlen's spies were too clever. She was discovered, and her last battle was here. I feel I made the wrong decision to help her. I think Avernus is a better choice. But... but... Enough. Do you have any proof of this? Any proof of her good deeds and bad? Poor ilk of this body. This one has nothing. Only words lost in the wind. The ordeal. Our business is at an end.
I keep my word. Now I can kill you with a clear concern. What? This one will grind your bones in my teeth. Ha 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 ha. You are still now a monster. We now we go ah! I cannot be defeated. You've done it, Warden. Soldier's Peak is safe again. Yeah. A good thing you took care of that Avernus. A blood mage. In the Wardens. Common folk should never hear of that. Some still distrust Wardens. Even in a blight. Crazy buggers. But there was no proof to redeem my family. Even if you had proof, Sophia's action with damning. I suppose they were at that. For so long, I was focused on the past. On answers. But I think I would have been better off had I stayed at home. Enough of that, though. I find myself at a loss. You've got a whole fortress now. I suppose I should start plying my trade again. That's good. Any chance I could convince you to stay on? You know I'm no good in a fight, but I'm a fair trader if I do say so myself. My cousins have been looking for a safe place to store trade goods, and the peak will do nicely. Whatever the Drydens have to offer are yours, for a sizable discount. That's Looks like good. we're done here. A demonic invasion thwarted, a warden base safely rescued, we do good work. Yes. Everyone is happy. Let's level up. Uh oh, only Liliana. Liliana, Liliana. One more level to unlock the last. Uh, it's one skill that... Make the rook to use cunning modifier instead of uh, strength for damage. Which one is? I don't know which one is that skill, man.
Oh, this one. Uh, okay, no more... Uh, Sophia, what you have? Ooh. Oh. Oh. Alisa, you can't equip these things. That's much more better, my friend. And the boots are insanely good. Look at him. He needs a good helmet, bro. Thirty eight strength. I think uh, I will e equip on him uh, the blood dragon armor. Anyway, this warden commander is very good. Uh, uh, Liliana, one zero five. A little bit. Six. Oh, that's better. Less fatigue. And more armor. Harder and better, yeah. Better. This robe of Avernus. Yeah, some nice upgrades. Some nice upgrades. Once my family comes, I might have some merchandise you could buy. Might tidy the place up a bit too. Uh, I well, think I need yeah. to leave and to come back here. And Levy will trade after that. I shall do it. is now it is I think I should leave and come back Somewhere here need to be a chest. What's one door here somewhere? Can we activate it now? The other side. I'm curious if I can use that door. Maybe when I come back. This statue is still here. I cannot interact. Oh, I can. Oh no, I cannot interact anymore with the stat. Let me leave and come again. I'm very curious. in the camp. <clears throat> 
<laughs> I have been studying Mother's grimoire. Do you yeah? wish to hear what I have found? Please, if you must. Tis not what I expected. I had hoped for a collection of her spells, a map of the power that she commands. But this is not it. Mm. Disturbed? Yes, perhaps that is the right word. One thing in particular within her writings disturbs me. Here, in great detail, Flemeth explains the means by which she has survived for centuries. Hmm. Because she's a witch. A spell of immortality. Oh, if only it were so. Flemeth has raised many daughters over her long lifetime. Hmm. There are stories of these many witches of the wilds throughout Chastened Legend, yet I have never seen a one, and always wondered why not. And now I know. They are all Flemeth. When her body becomes old and wizened, she raises a daughter. And when the time is right, she takes her daughter's body for her own. Oh my god. Oh my god. Are you sure about this? Indeed. That is primarily what this tome details. The various daughters that Flemeth has acquired. Their preparation and training. I recognize all of it. I am to be her next host. This is my purpose. Are you kidding me? Why she risk sending you with me? I do not know. Perhaps tis as she said, the Darkspawn threaten her as much as they threaten anyone else. Or perhaps she believes that this journey will make me more powerful. According to the tome, if the host is already powerful and trained in magic, it takes far less time for Flemeth to settle in. Man, are you kidding me? So if you die, she will have another daughter. Not by any natural means. Perhaps I should take this as a vote of confidence from her on my capabilities. Or perhaps she simply wished me gone from the Kokari wilds so she could prepare her ritual in peace. A disturbing thought. And you had no idea. I'm so sorry. So what do you intend to do about? There is only one possible response to this. Flemeth needs to die. I will not sit about like an empty sack waiting to be filled. Flemeth must be slain, and I need your help to do it. Of course. Uh, perhaps maybe you should talk to her about it first. And what would that do? At best, I would receive pointless reassurances. At worst, Flemeth would imprison me once she became aware I know what I do. I know my mother well enough to be confident she would show no mercy when it came to her own survival. I must do the same. Very well. I'll help you if I can. Then what needs to be done is for you to go back to Flemeth's hut in the Kakari wilds without me. If I am present when she is slain, I cannot be certain that she will not be able to possess my body right then. So I must remain at the camp, confront her, and slay her quickly. I doubt she will truly be dead even then, but it will take her years to find a new host and recover her power, if that is even possible. The thing I must have is her true grimoire. With it, I can defend against her power in the future, Everything else in her hut is yours. Do I have a time limit on this? Not really, but the sooner the better, no? Are you serious? Killing Clement, a witch of the world? 
<laughs> she would like everyone to think she is invincible, but I highly doubt that is the case. And besides that, you are not truly killing her. I'll see what I can do. I am grateful. The sooner this can be done, the sooner it will set my mind at ease. Oh my god. Morrigan disapproved? Are you kidding me? I I killed a witch for her and she disapproved? This, that's crazy. Are you crazy, Morrigan? A lie, supply, craze? What is that? For the resources you have collected for your troops. Man, what the fuck I'm doing? You are wise to invest in the effectiveness of your followers. The Circle of Magi stands ready to assist, Grey Warden, as do the Templars of the Chantry. Do you need anything? There are always areas to improve on, Grey Warden. The most useful for my talents are runes. Wait a second. <clears throat> Let me... Uh, ba, ba, ba. Stan. Okay. 175. Oh, wait. Nothing better for him. Okay, not even weapons, of course, you have crow dagger and enchanted dagger. Uh, what about the win? All nature, spirit, mental. Okay, nothing else to equip for none of them. Enchantment? Enchantment! Something you need? 
I'm sure either my boy or I can help you out. Yeah, you are your boy. Let me see. I'm sure you'll be pleased with the goods my boy and I have collected, and with your discount. Uh. Keep this rope sixty. Mm. Oh, two hundred. Fifty-eight. Mm. Oh, that's gifts. Uh, bu, bu. I don't know, I can sell some ingredients, I think. I don't plan to level up the crafting soon, I prefer other things than crafting. Ugly boots as a gift. I don't know if these gifts are for these companions. <laughs> okay, we are good. Uh, now let's try to go back to the keep for a second. I'm very curious if indeed, indeed. Yes. Is something changed? Or maybe you need to go to another place. Oh no. Yeah. A dog. Hey bro. Very well. Here is my storage chest. These are for the golem companion. I think now I, I will focus to do that. To get the golem companion. Uh, I can... Uh, the ingredients... It's an unlimited space in this storage box. That's, that's great. Welcome back, Warden. As you can see, we've been busy. Clean the place up a bit. Even my brother Mikhail came out of hiding. Never will you find a finer smith. Also, got some goods stored here that might interest you. Buy them now before my cousins move it all someplace else. I'd like to see what you have. Certainly. First, 
you don't have a backpack. It's bad, man. That's bad. You have only shit. Give me this flask. Just in case. Now you are not rich, bro. Wait, any dialogue what option with him? Warden? Did you tell your family about Sophia? I thought about it, but I figured that it's not a bad thing to believe that you come from a line of lions, even if the truth is a touch more complicated. Our family's belief that we were wronged, it gave us strength to make something of ourselves. Uh, and what do you think of Sophia? King Arlen sounded like a right nasty piece of work. Sophia was branded a traitor. She consorted with blood mages. But in spite of it all, I think she was a hero. Okay. The kid looks a lot different. We've a big family. When you were away, we all pitched in. Hard to believe there were undead, demons and worse around here, right? Yeah. Take care of yourself. Goodbye. Okay, there's... Oh, you cannot go inside anymore? Something changed inside? Uh, no. Looks like you cannot go inside anymore. Okay. Lev is near you. Hey, buddy. Our family owes you a great deal. Look at that. Yeah, bro, that was a nice gift from me. You? Oh. You're the warden? My family owes you. Any weapons I make, I will sell you for a discount. Ah, can I see? Oh, two rune slots. Oh, bro. Bro. Looks interesting what you have. Grey Warden Helmet. And only the weapons can have runes, the armor cannot. Or uh, this guy. Yeah, because he said weapon. I think it's a weapon master, not armor master. Uh. I want to have, oh, comparing items with the uh, Zevran. Yeah, this, oh wait, Zvan, the Stan. 32, I don't know how much strength he had. Anyway, I, I, I don't buy, I don't spend money for weapons. I'm okay. But Warden. The, the other option, your little brother, not much of a family, okay. I have a family full of traders living a soft life, getting fat. I chose to learn the way of metal and stone. It keeps me strong. Uh, you had a weapon with them. Indeed. I have spent my life studying steel, dragon bone, and more. I learned all I could in human lands, and exiled dwarves taught me more. Give me the finest metals and materials, and I can make wonders for you. Okay. I found this strange metal in a crater. Oh. This... This is star metal. If you give this to me, I will craft for you a thing of legend. Good. Ah, a star metal long sword. How much will it cost me? 
Nothing. My family owes you much. So you can make me a one-handed longsword or a two-handed sword? Uh, I don't know if it will be better than uh, the sword that have now, Alistair, but maybe a two-handed for Sam? No, bro, make, make me one-handed. And so it shall be. Wow. Look at it that. It is done. I call this blade Starfang. May it serve you well. I must rest after my exertions. Oh. Warden. Okay, you are tired. Okay, I understand. Alistair. Star Fang. Three dexterity, three damage, two point five armor penetration, and three slots. Enchantment slots. Ooh. Wow, it's better. It's better. More damage for him. Star Fang. Amazing. Uh, nice. This green blade. I don't know if if she, she get a bonus. Wait a sec. No, she don't get a bonus for uh, two daggers. It is begun. Okay. And uh, this guy is a weaponsmith. Is it armor smith as well here? I don't think. Maybe at the other side. I I think, yes. What the fuck are these ravens? Our family owes you a great deal. The only uh, weapons made, not the armors made. Okay. How to start the golem quest line? Here or here? What is here?
Take a closer look at the unarmed man. King Kailan Honor Guard. Hmm. Take a closer look at the guard. Ban Loran. They killed him. Motherfuckers. There is no glory in bloodshed. I think that hardened letter uh, are good for Liliana. It not here. I think you start the quest line for uh, for the golem. You remember him as Elric. Marain, a member of Kailan Honor Guard at Osgar, Ostagar, and the close group Thank you. I, I didn't expect the band's men to notice my escape so quickly. I tried to hide here in the woods, but there wasn't time. And now I'm a dead man. I tried to help. You were there in Ostagar. You know how things went. For me, it was either this, or die in some dark spawn's belly, or, or be hung as a deserter. You deserted? I dare say most people think the same of you and me, if not worse. I fled the battlefield when Loghain betrayed us. I abandoned my men, and they died. And Caelan with them. He was my king, my friend, maker. All that time in Ban Loren's prison. And I couldn't stop thinking about all they suffered that one dark night at Ostagar. It's not your fault he died, bro. I know. Even had Loghain's men not turned their backs on us, the Darkspawn were too many. Even Kalen, for all his bravado, knew there would be no victory at Ostagar. The king entrusted me with the key to the royal arms chest. If anything were to happen to him, he said, it was vital I deliver it to the Wardens. Is this chest important? Why didn't he just give the key to Duncan? He didn't get the chance. Duncan was so busy with the new recruits and keeping Loghain at bay. Whatever his reasoning, it's me Kaelin entrusted it to. You still have the key? The Maker has a sense of humor, doesn't he? I suppose it's for the best, however. Had I kept it, it would be in Ban Loren's hands by now. Why am I not surprised? Is there someone else we should be bringing back from the brink of death instead? I was afraid. I thought I would lose it on the battlefield, so I stashed it in the camp. Please, it's probably still there. Where? The key's behind a loose stone at the base of a statue. I'll draw a map for you, so you'll know where to search. You'll be taking me along, won't you? And win as well, I suspect. Call me sentimental, but we left behind some darkspawn that really deserve a drubbing. It is vital that the King's documents do not fall into the wrong hands. As for Merrick's sword, it is too powerful to be poured at by those monsters. 
Same for the king's other arms and armor. And... And if you happen to find Caelan's body, see it off. He was our king. He shouldn't be left to rot amidst the Darkspawn's filth. Beep. Dead. We're good. Return to Ostaga. I don't know if I will do that now. Wait, no, something else here? No, it's a small map. 